In this video, we're going to take a look at how we can move, copy, and group files and folders on the Mac. Let's go to my Mac. Let's first open up a couple of Finder windows. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down to my Finder here, click on it, and we have one Finder window. With this one, what we're going to do is we're going to go to our Documents folder. Now let's go and open up a new window. I'm going to use Command-N, and now we have another window. With this one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my Downloads folder. So now we have my two folders here. Let's first look at how we move files. Pretty simple. All we have to do is just click and drag from one folder to the other. So I want to move my travel brochure. I just click and drag, and I moved it. It did not copy it. What it did is it moved it. Now let's say I wanted to copy it. In this case, what I want to do is I want to copy this animals document. Now I still click and drag to move it over to the other folder. But now what I need to do is I need to also hold down the Option key. When I hold down the Option key and click and drag, you're going to see we have a green plus. This means that it's going to duplicate that document. So now when I go over to this folder here with that green plus, that means that it is going to duplicate it. It's going to copy it. So now I have my animals document here, and I have my animals document here. So I can just click and drag, and it'll move it from one folder to another. If I use the Option key, what it'll do is it'll copy it. And this also works with folders. I could go over to this folder here, and then just click and drag it over, and it'll move it over. If I hold down the Option key, it'll copy it. Now let's say you wanted to move it to a different drive, such as a flash drive or an external hard drive. In my case, what I have here is my Drobo. I want to move a file over there. Well, when you click and drag to move a file, what it actually will do is it will copy it over there. Let's go and open up my Drobo. I'm going to move this window over a little bit here. And now when I drag this over there, remember how we had the green plus only when I held down the Option key? Well, watch what happens when I drag this over to my Drobo. I have the green plus. I'm not holding down the Option key. When you drag a file to an external drive, such as a flash drive or an external hard drive, what it actually does is it copies it. It does not move it. So now what I'll need to do, I'm going to go ahead and let go here. What I'll need to do is I'll need to go and delete it from my original hard drive. Because what it did is it copied it. So now to delete it, I'm just going to use a keyboard shortcut. Command delete. So that's how we move a file over to an external drive. When we move a file over, what it actually does is it copies it. So now we have to go back to the original file and delete it. Now we can also group files into a folder. Let's go and select these images here. What I want to do is I want to place those into a folder. Well, one way of doing that is going up to File in the menu bar and then going and create a new folder and then moving them over to that folder. But also what we can do is we can go and create a new folder with my selection. So now what this will do is this will create a new folder and any file that I have selected will be placed in that new folder. So let's go ahead and do this. And now we can see we have my new folder. I can go and name it. So let's just call this Images. And when we go and open up the triangle here, you're going to see I have my four images. We can also use our secondary menu to do this. So I have these three movies here. Let's go and select them. What I want to do is I want to place them in a new folder. I'm going to use my secondary menu. I can use a control key and then click, or being that I have a trackpad, I just two finger tap, and you're going to see we have new folder with selection. I select it, and now I just name it, and when we open it up, we have my three movies in there. So that's how we move, copy, and group items into a folder. If we're moving a file or a folder from one folder to another on the same hard drive, it'll just move it. It will not copy it. To copy it, you hold down the Option key. 
If you're moving a file or folder to an external drive, such as a flash drive, what it will do is it will copy it by default. And then what we have to do is we have to go and delete the original file. If you want to create a new folder with your selected items, you just select your items and then you go up under File in the menu bar and then create a new folder with your selection. So that's how we move, copy, and group items on the Mac.